Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I thought that I would film a one brand makeup look. And the brand that I'm going to be using today is Bobbi Brown. I already started by applying my a little bit of foundation and I only used a really small amount of this because it's very uh, medium to full coverage and it is buildable. I use the Intensive Skin Serum Foundation. It's really great because it has an SPF of 25. And then I mixed um, a little small dot of this Bear Glow Extra Illuminating Moisture Balm. And these go really well together. Such a great combination. And um, I really like the way my skin looks. looks very natural still. And now I'm going to go in with this concealer. So I'm just going to get some coffees today. And I thought I would film this quick makeup look. So I'm just going to apply a little bit of this concealer. This concealer has a thicker consistency. So it's really great if you want to cover blemishes as well. This is the Instant Full Cover Concealer and I've had this one for a while as well. Love this, this brush, this Real Techniques brush for blending in concealer. It's so soft. Always just patting the excess. I have this Bobbi Brown Micro Brow Pencil in the shade Saddle, which is kind of like a medium brown shade. First, I brush up my eyebrows. And small strokes, I just fill in the blank spots. And I kind of line up the end of my brow to this kind of angle here, so I extend it a little bit. I love this long wear cream shadow stick, which I featured in my favorites video, my recent one. And this is a beautiful bronze golden shade, perfect for summertime. And when you don't have a lot of time, and you just want to create a really quick smoky eye. Kind of just apply it like that and blend it. These shadow sticks are one of my favorite formulas because they're so easy to use and you have a bit of time to blend them as well. You can also use it as a liner as well. If you don't want to use it as an eyeshadow, you can kind of just create a little wing with it as well. I'm going to put some underneath my eye as well. And I just use my, my pinky finger to kind of buff that in a little bit. You can use a brush if you want to, but I find that this product works really well with your fingers. And you don't need to use a lot of brushes for mascara this is the bobby brown smoky eye mascara i use this one all the time it gives you this really nice thick black lashes so what's really important for me it actually doesn't leave um, any smudging up the top which happens to me a lot with mascara i think because my eyelashes touch that area so um, sometimes that can happen, but with this one, it doesn't. So that's mascara done. And now I'm just going to use this um, Golden Lights Bronzing Powder Duo in the shade Antigua and Golden Lights. So how I apply my bronzer is I don't contour my face really. I kind of just do a three like that. And 
And then I always apply some on my neck. Because I feel like if you apply bron if you apply bronzer on your face, um, and then you don't apply it to your neck and chest, it can look um, a little bit out of place. So I always like to just kind of match everything up. For blush, I have this shade Sand Pink, which I really love. It's just their standard blushes, but this one doesn't have any glitter in there. I have a thing for matte blush. I really like it because if you wear matte blush, it's very flattering and then you can always add highlight on top because a lot of blushes do contain mica or shimmering pigments in there. And then sometimes you can get um, quite a lot of shimmer here, especially in the daytime. And then if you have larger pores, on your cheeks that can really stand out and if you don't want that it's really nice to wear more of a matte blush and then you can control where you apply your illuminator or highlighter so again on the same brush just to keep things really simple with my makeup so this is a really nice kind of medium pink this is very pigmented so i applied probably too much there I apply a little bit on my nose, so as you can see that straight away gives me the look of more of a sun-kissed skin. And you can definitely do it because it's a matte blush, so you're not going to have like glitter on your nose. So it instantly gives me that pop of colour. And now for highlighter, I'm going to go back in with this um, Bare Glow, which I used, I mixed a little bit of this before. So I applied a little bit of that on my top of my cheekbones and it doesn't have glitter in either. And I wanted to show you this because it's very versatile. You can apply it on your, um, like mix in with your moisturizer just to give your skin this really nice luminosity. And you can also apply it with your foundation. You can apply it to your cheeks and your skin's going to look very dewy, very glowy. Um, there is a little bit of a sheen there but um, it's more pearlescent, so you don't have that really heavy glitter on your face, which is really nice to have. I think it will suit everybody. There's different shades. This is the Bare Glow. So this is more of the translucent to white translucent base one. There is like a pink glow and there's a golden glow and there might be some others, I'm not sure. For my lips, I'm going to apply one of my favorite lip pencils ever it's rum raisin and i'm just going to line my lips slightly i line my lips i'm giving you all my tips and tricks now <laughs> Um, I just get my finger and I kind of dab it so it, you won't see that there's a harsh line. I just do that to kind of keep a little bit of color on my lips and to shape my lips even more. Then I'm going to use this shade here. It's a really beautiful lip kind of balm. I think it's like a hybrid between a balm and a lipstick. And this is in the shade Blush, which it's just a really nice everyday neutral Kind of shade it gives you a little bit of gloss on your lips so it just makes your lips look really moisturized and kind of plumped up so everyone this is my kind of go-to everyday bronze glowy kind of makeup look that i love to do using my bobby brown products I hope that you enjoyed this video and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye guys.